now what we're going to do is show you guys where the Nomad's kept. So it is in the same closet as the sensors are. So it's in our sterile storage supply. So this is the Nomad. You can actually see a label right here. The box says Nomad, but also under on this shelf, this is the second battery that we have. So once the battery inside is dead, we're just going to switch them out. So when you're in clinic and not radiology lab, it's going to be the clinic aide's responsibility to retrieve the Nomad in between each session. So I'm just going to open it up. As you can see, it fits inside just like a puzzle. So I'm going to take it out and I'm going to attach the handle, which is the battery. So when you attach it, you want it to slide just like a lock and key until it clips. Now we know it's secure. If we look at the power settings, they're pretty self-explanatory. Here's our power button. We can see our battery life, our patient, that's an adult. This is a child. Right here, our film, this is for digital. That's for film. And this is for phosphorus plates, which we don't use in the clinic. If you jump down to the tooth, here are for our bite wings. As you can see, the KVPs are also changing. Here's for our anterior periapicals, and here's for our posterior periapicals. So what I'm gonna show you is the trigger of the Nomad. When you want to enable your x-rays, you click it once pretty quick. And then once you're ready to go, you actually hold this button down until it beeps at the end. Now what I'm going to do is show you what that actually looks like. So I'm going to power this off and I'm going to turn it back on. So my quick click says enabling and now it says ready. Once it says ready, that means you're going to hold your Nomad up ready to go and you're going to physically hold down your trigger for exposure.